In a sport that requires laser focus, Alexei Prokopchuk can't help but be distracted. And bombarding new cities like Dnipro for the first How difficult has it been to play tennis this year? There's like this pressure like from home, it's like stays with you through like all this time. I just hope it's gonna be done soon. Alexei is the only Ukrainian born student on Biola University's campus. While he attempts to balance life as a student athlete, his mind often wanders to his native Dnipro in eastern Ukraine. It's where his grandmother, father, and younger brother live. And it's currently a war zone. And it's just stressful, but thanks God they're still like alive and they like have options. Yeah, of course it's like tough to see when your family like in this situation and it's like I don't know how to help them. They started telling me stories about his grandmother who is trying to tend her sheep. Her entire net worth are in the hundred sheep that she has. has and he says, well, why don't you just like leave the country? And she says, I can't because this is all I've got. Family comes in all forms. The Biola community, led by University President Barry Corey, is standing shoulder to shoulder with one of their own. Well, there's this verse in scripture, like when one of us mourns, we all mourn together. And that's kind of what it is in a community like Biola. We're trying to walk with Alexi right now. We care deeply about him. We love him. And we want to be part of the way in which he is kind of processing so much dis kind of destruction. And one of the ways you guys are supporting him is, is through this GoFundMe page. Why was it important? So this is not a top-down thing. This is grassroots. And his friends have said, Vic, we want to help you. So they initiated this GoFundMe page and um, a chance for him to get some support. I don't like this type of attention and like I didn't want to ask for this, so they're in charge of this. Basically, like, I beyond grateful for them. Alexei isn't Biola's only connection to Ukraine. The university's Talbot School of Theology is an extension site located in Kyiv. We've been getting word of the students at the seminary. They're part of uh, supplying food and clothing and medicine and evacuation relief and helping uh, refugees who are looking for a place to hunker down. So it's not just the work that they're doing on their academics. They're rolling up their sleeves and and, and, and giving charitably and graciously to a community that really needs it right now. Lessons come from unprecedented adversity. For Alexei, it's simple. Once I called my father and like he told me, war will be over, like sooner or later. Yeah, we hope it's, you're not gonna have many losses, but you should keep going. This is the goal of life, just keep going. And if you like fall or like something doesn't work, just try to figure out, like don't give up.